939. We are celebrating Small Business Month, and so we're shining a light on a black-owned dance studio. Bob Kelly, Burlington County. Oh, can we stop for a second? I've been dancing all through the commercial break. I gotta take a break. Let's have a hand for the Amped Up the Dance Gang here. You guys are looking good. We are in the shaders, with the shaders today, Maple Shade. Hi, Dana, how are you? I'm doing well. So tell me about your dance studio. So we are the dance studio where passion meets movement. Okay, we... hold on, we got the passion. Yeah. So let's get dancing, go ahead, go on. <laughs> Hit it, five, six, seven, eight, boom. Let me see y'all jump in that. Get it, get it, get it. So we always have to warm up. We want to make sure we're always That's warmed we're up before okay. we do any type of dance. Okay. And here at Amsterdam Dance, we foster self-confidence and creativity through dance in a fun, energetic environment. They're so it's all, all about the vibe. It's all about the energy. All energetic. I love it. And this is getting all that energy out. There's no cell phones. No. Right? No. So when you come to class, you need to focus. That's so right. we start at two years old. And okay. even our babies, they're focused. We go all the way to 17. Wow. and adults. We've had somebody 66 come to Zumba classes. So when, how did you get started doing this? So here's the thing. I've been dancing since I was a little, Keep little dancing. Baby. Let's go. Don't dancing, be taking right? no breaks on me here. Uh, so since I've been a little girl, I've been dancing. Uh, okay. My mother, God rest her soul, uh, she fostered that passion. Mm -hmm. uh, she made me dance for church and praise dance and mime. And it's just something that never left me. So I decided that I wanted to do this, that I wanted this to be uh, my life mm -hmm. dance in 2020 i decided to open a dance studio now i did not know <laughs> i right. did not know that it was going to be COVID, right that the world was going to be shut down yeah. so i was nervous i was scared uh i didn't you know i didn't really see hope but i never lost my faith right and we were able to open with a summer camp first and then go into our dance season that's so I'm, i mean it's been a blessing it's been an amazing uh three years and we started with 67 wow. kids the first wow. year 88 go. kids the yeah. second year and now 116 boom 116 yes, yes, you know well we couldn't have done it without our sponsor Wispus. now you know can tell what's tell me the importance of a small business like this in the neighborhoods well small business is so key to not only bringing smiles to kids faces but you know serving families serving our communities and creating jobs but really most importantly they drive our economy they're at the mm -hmm. heart of everything we do and they make a difference um, those dollars go back into the communities uh, through their patronage and helping, you know, others have their biz their business and their families thrive. So we really enjoy the impact. Yeah. And also the stories, the success of those small businesses like really energize us. Well, thank you for all you do because yeah. again, you know, with your help, you were able to put this together, have a place for the kids to dance. Well, look, jobs for everybody. Look, this is this is the crazy part. We just bought a building. So we have a two-story building. That's what Whispers helped us do. Wow. We bought a two-story building, and now we're going to open up our space, two floors, and we hope to have 200 kids next right. year. You hold the microphone. Yeah, I, I got it. Dance. All right, okay. let's pump Come it. Come on, here we go. Oh, here we go. Let's pump here it. We go. Hey, step. Come on. Touch. Touch. Oh, I'm ready touch. for the recital. All I'm right. Ready for the recital. <laughs> With the shaders. Well, He's coming, you guys. <laughs> Thank you, Bob. Yeah.